AC, the Red Pill Alpha, back at you fellas again with this motherfucking heat. Keeping our foot on these bitches' necks, our feet. Give a fuck. Pick up a boulder off the brick, throw it in the back of the bitch's neck. All knowledge. Bitch, this is what it is. Not literally throw a brick in their neck, not literally keep your foot on, not literally dropping an anchor, not literally doing these things to her. But metaphorically, we keep our foot on these bitches' necks. Letting them know that we ain't letting nothing up. Y'all got us fucked up. Please like, share, subscribe. Hit the notification bell. Leave me with a comment. <clears throat> Get at me at my email. RealReal81 at Yahoo.com That's R-E-L-L R-E-L-L 81 at Yahoo.com Let me know what's on your mind. Check this out. I was at the gym today. And I seen something come across TV at the gym. I'm working out. So I see the little Wendy Williams show or whatnot, talking about Pub Daddy, P. Diddy, and how he's messing with a young 35, 36-year-old chick, <clears throat> and he's in his 50s. Fellas, what I'm trying to come to y'all, let y'all know, all my guys, all my dudes, all my men with honor, all my men that's um, thinking that they got to settle in so fast, all my men that's thinking they got to get married so fast. And a lot of these guys get married so fast because bitches don't want they ass. Let's keep it real. So they rather would settle down with a woman and, you know, I want, I was just me and her. And, you know, I I played the field. I, nigga, you ain't enough fucking up with two, three holes in your life, nigga. You fat out of shape. You ain't got shit going. Let's keep it real. You a bum. You a piece of shit. Bitches don't want you. So you settled in. You gave your life up, nigga. Early. Like, fuck it. I bet you have your ass was on your um grind. You had these guns, you had a six-pack and shit, nigga, you had your own pads, houses, property, cars and shit, your value is so high, your confidence is so high, you wouldn't give a fuck about settling down because you got so many bad bitches throwing it at you. That's how I'm feeling. That's how I'm moving. I don't give a fuck. Now, back to what I was saying. Wendy Williams was kind of feeling salty about... Did he fucking with a chick much younger than him? Why he couldn't get a nurse? Why he couldn't get a doctor? Why he couldn't get a lawyer? You know, she's on the girl he's dealing with. She owns a a, a Mexican restaurant in L.A. and he's got so much money. Puff Daddy got this net. Daddy got this. He's worth a billion dollars or whatever she was saying. You know. And the reason why he don't want no chick his age. No, none of those nurses, doctors, and whatever it is around his age, because they his a they old. We men, we we get old. We all do get old, but we're more valuable. Why? Because we resourceful. We're gonna always get that money. You can always get that money. You fuck them young as 20, 19, 18, as grown as they are. You can fuck them. As long as your shit together. What woman you know that don't want no man to support them? What woman you know that don't want no man that uh that's gonna protect them? Give them the success of security. You know, what woman you know that wants a bum? I don't give a fuck how old she, her, her preference may be into a man. Do she want a bum? Fuck no. I don't give a fuck if she's a 21-year-old chick. A 22-year-old dude, she ain't gonna want him because she may consider that he ain't better than her. Which, really, he's not because he is 22. She's 21. She's in the best years of her life at that age. That's why they fuck with a lot of older men when they're young. They bad as fuck at that age. They know that. They don't know. They they really don't know they worth yet. That's why they get dogged out, get get fucked around by the older guys, the dudes that got their shit together. Why? It's because they, for one, they don't know they worth. And for two, her value is stupid high. She's at a young age. Now, when she hit 30 and better, the value is going, you know how that is, like a plane crash. But Diddy don't want no woman that's, 50 years old, tried up ass pussy, all those motherfucking mouths on it. Let's keep it real. What the fuck he look like fucking with somebody his age, all them motherfucking mouths on it. Menopause, if not pushing menopause. She hit the wall, bow. What the fuck he need some that old for? So he went back younger. Why? Because he's resourceful. He can do that. When you're resourceful, you can do that. Women, best years, remember. From 18 to 30, in my opinion, some men give them 25. I give them 18 to 30. I push that 30 mark there. 
That's my opinion. And men, we don't start becoming more valuable until we start reaching our peak. That's like 30 or better. That's when we start knowing our value. That's when we start getting rid of the bullshit games and becoming high value. Knowing what we want out of life. We want these chips. We want to own things. We want ownership. We want to fuck bad bitches forever. We want to break their backs out for the rest of our fucking lives. And how you do that is having your shit together. And don't be banging these bitches your age. If you older, don't bang them. Go get you something younger. It's, wor it's, it's worth it. Trust me. Fuck that dried up pussy washed up shit, man. That's why Diddy did that. That's why he don't want nobody his age. Just to answer her question. If she don't know. And if they don't know, they gonna get the picture. Because all the fellas that watch my shit and everybody else shit like mine, it's gonna raise up out of the dead and we're gonna get you bitches. Holla.